welcome back to my channel. So today we're going to be talking all about goals. And some of you guys may be like, listen, my life is in God's hands. Like I don't plan, I don't goal. That's cool if it's you, but I do feel like planning is biblical. The only thing I would say is just knowing that whatever happens because the Lord is sovereign, it's in his will. Um, but it's nothing wrong with planning and setting goals for yourself. So I have five of my goals that I'm going to discuss today. So if you're interested, stay tuned. Okay, so my very first goal is to become a better friend. At the end of the day, when you have a career like mine, which is teaching, it takes up a lot of your time and it's very, very hard for you to schedule intentionally um, with your friends. And you kind of like brush it off and then you guys end up not speaking for a while but my goal is to truly be intentional with my friendships because I know um, as I move throughout different seasons of my life as far as like me one day getting married like it's so much harder to make and develop and maintain friendship so I think that the time is now as far as friendships goes so I just feel like um, me taking the time to intentionally plan when we're gonna meet up and me taking the time to initially do checkup calls to be like hey how are you how are you doing so on like I definitely want that to be something I don't even start in 2018 but like right now because I think that it's really really good for you just to maintain your friendships I don't feel like your boyfriend should be your only friend I don't feel like you should not talk to anybody be due to certain circumstances such as like your job or busy life um, so yeah that's definitely one of my goals for 2018 my second goal which I'm extremely extremely excited about is that I want to make like soul style beauty a community so if you follow me on social like Twitter or Instagram you would see that I've been working on some things and I just created like a linked group for the Facebook page um, it's just basically strengthening the community anybody can post on that page anyone can post that they need prayer anybody can post just about anything um, so I'll leave the link down down below but I want it to be more so like a community like we can serve the community together I said that I want to do the God's Girls brunch but I feel like let's strengthen the community first let's uh, cultivate and develop a friendship first so I'm so excited for the things that's gonna come um, I'm also working on some things with um, the blog so it's just I'm just so excited for what's to come like I feel like this is such a God idea so um, if you're interested in joining the group, it's down below. Like I said, it's just a group filled with Christian women learning how to be vulnerable, learning um, to just um, seek the word daily. So that's like my goal for the ultimate like soul style beauty. However, I do blog about beauty and fashion and style and faith. Um, but this is just another branch of it as far as like the community aspect, which God has been laying on my heart more and more and more. So I'm super excited for what's to come. But yeah, that's definitely a goal. So my third goal would be to increase independency on God. And I feel like no one can say that they do this enough because I feel like oftentimes in little ways that we move, we don't realize that it's like, hey, like I'm actually depending on me right now. I'm not depending on what God says or what his word says or relying on his strength, but I'm relying on myself. So in like little things, like as far as my blog and like if somebody doesn't like it, I may be offended by it or if somebody doesn't support. It's kind of like, well, this is what God has been speaking to you. And regardless of what anybody else says or anybody else thinks, like that is my hope. That is what I'm anchoring myself on, you know, like we're anchoring myself to. Um, so, yeah, just having a dependency on just trusting everything that he says, not relying on myself. Um, another um, thing that I want to discuss in another video was just like little things that we may do on a day to day. It's like, OK, if I'm not feeling good, like I'm not going to pretend to feel good at the end of the day, because we as Christians wasn't just called to be good people, just be kind of vulnerable um, and you allow yourself that space to be honest and I feel like any good work in you is produced by the Holy Spirit it's none of us so I just feel like me depending on him any day will produce the good that I want to see come to fruition so my fourth goal would be to be intentional with my blogging so I'm definitely gonna do a shameless plug so go visit www.soulstopity.com I put two new blog posts up there one um, in regards to soul one in regards to beauty but I definitely want to become more intentional so definitely subscribe um, definitely hold me accountable join that Facebook group and like be like yo E where's the blog post what are you doing be consistent get back at it and um, that's one of my like I think that 
I have such a passion for it, but then sometimes you get discouraged as a creative too. And it's like, that's one thing that I feel like, you know, God would honor. Like if he has called me to do this as far as like being me, like and still representing him and still reaching people, then he'll give me um, the grace to be consistent. So I just pray, say, um, so I just realized that me like praying even more every single day and making it a part of my prayers to be consistent, like he will grant me that. Um, so yeah, it's been going good. So I just ask that you guys subscribe. But yeah, that's definitely one of my goals to be consistent in blogging um, on my website as well as my YouTube. So my last goal would be to make more healthy eating decisions and more like healthy decisions on the way that I live. I know that I have a goal now to go to the gym once a week, which is kind of like pretty easy to do, I feel like. So I used to start out with these huge goals, like I'm gonna go to the gym three times a week, I'm gonna crush it, like that's too much. Like start little and then build up from there. So I was like, okay, one a week is manageable. Um, but I think that it's also good for stress, like as teachers, we're stressed constantly, like we have tons of deadlines. Um, so I think that me like managing stress in a positive way that would be good as well, like going to the gym once a week. And then also making better choices. Um, and not to say like completely like eating, going cold turkey, like vegan or vegetarian, but like making more healthy eating choices. And I think that goal is attainable and it's something that I can manage and it'll be something that will keep my body in shape and make me a healthier individual so i hope that you guys enjoyed this video this was just five of my goals but i'm definitely going to be posting more on the bloggy blog so definitely subscribe um as soon as you go over to my blog it has a subscribe pop up for you so definitely put in your email address to stay updated about giveaways stay updated about newsletters about posts just about everything um definitely subscribe and